principle that every member of Congress, regardless of party, should have. You should never want to get to the point where you have to where you have to impeach a president. But if you have to impeach a president, you need to take a responsibility. Should you have to. Agenda? Do you agree with that principle? Uh, do you agree that no. a member of Congress should exercise the Actually, exercise the responsibility? Uh, do you agree with? Do, 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 okay. okay. Good. Because then we, then we disagree on. Then we disagree on that. Sure. Because the members of Congress should be there to act in the behalf of the people and not on the, their political agenda. Or so the Constitution is really clear. It gives the authority of impeachment to members of Congress, right? Yes. And, and, it's, and if you look at all the responsibilities of Congress that the Constitution provides to members of Congress, in a grand scheme of things, there aren't many specifically laid out. This is one of them. So, uh, so fine. We disagree. I think it's a responsibility that I some at some day in the future might have to exercise. But my principle applies to any president, not just this one. Any president. Your second question about uh, I don't know, I'm relitigating the history of this. I, you know, you, that's that's coffee room coffee shop talk. I, I don't. I can't tell you what happened four days after the election. I was still celebrating because I won. <laughs> no, the, the second part of the question was about that, you know, six years worth of the tax returns. Oh, I, was there something specific that you're looking for or just another witch hunt? Um, those are my only choices? Uh, I'm looking for an explanation. Are those my only choices? Uh, no, you can have as many as you want. Okay, they make it 10 years. They make, they make it 15. That's precedent. You have to, you have to pick a date. Is it a precedent? Well, they, they've been doing it for the last four or five presidents. It's nothing just for him. Yeah, I think probably. I don't know that why five years, but it probably has something to do with the fact that president, presidential candidates who have run in the past have released their tax returns. And back to Nixon. And that um, perhaps we pick five years because presidential candidates have released five years of tax returns. I can double check on that for you. But I don't think it's a witch hunt. I don't think he's a witch. I think he's a terrible president. I think he deserves all the oversight we can give him. I also think he deserves to sign legislation that will create a lot of jobs and infrastructure as well. And he, to, and he ought to be supportive of that. I think he ought to support my bill to, um, to 